What is going on, everybody? DJ Minds here. All right, I have some really awesome news, exciting news. We picked up not one, but two of the new Intel GPUs. We'll talk about that in just a second. And basically, these are not sold anywhere on the market, to my knowledge, except for China. You cannot pick them up in Europe or America or any of that. You kind of have to know a guy, which fortunately enough, I do know a guy. If you remember um, when I got my Koi miner, my Bitcoin ASIC miner, which is like a cheaper version of Bitmain, I got it from my friend Charlie. He's also a YouTuber. He also got me a custom A4000 kit which was only sold in china so shout out to my boy charlie i put a link in the description below for him so new and fresh it actually smells really good and yeah i can trust him i purchased a lot of things from him and he's a fellow youtuber so the first one he called it the g3 i got this from charlie actually and very hard to find like i said you can't find these pretty much anywhere this is a four gigabyte card and yeah i don't know much about it man there's really no information i don't even know what to call it so if you guys know what to call it yeah, definitely let me know. And the TDP for this is only 25 watts, 25 watts. And here's the GPU, as you can see. Now, this one I didn't test yet. I did test the A380. But uh, yeah, this one is looking sleek, dude. I don't know. Maybe this is actually an A330. I, I really genuinely don't know because it's four gigabyte. So I'm not really sure how this fits into there. Here you're going to see where it says Gunner from Intel. And I believe that's just the Chinese labels. I don't know for sure. Uh, but anyways, other than that, we got the A380, which is probably what you're all looking forward to, man. And I have to say this thing in real life is awesome looking. I mean, I, I love this. This is really great. And so I'll, in a different video, in a future video, I will do hash rates and overclocks and all that. And I'll tell you why I can't do it. It's not because I don't want to do it. There's definitely some complications. But if you just look at this GPU, look at that, man. Sleep design i'm sorry that i'm just showing you on a webcam but this thing is pretty man beautiful card i love it really pops out and uh yeah not sponsored obviously like intel's not going to sponsor me or anything so let's talk about some of the complications so for the a380 graphics cards i was able to get the driver this is straight from intel's website i got very very excited and here you can see it man it looks a lot different than like nvidia or amd or anything else that you're used to and so obviously i got very excited and i was like wow man this is gonna work and then is where we kind of ran into some problems after updating my gpu z you can see this is a real intel arc a380 graphics card this is six gigabyte now the problem is since we are on windows i know hive unfortunately has not even got their hands on this card to my knowledge we would not be able to test out ethereum because it is six gigabyte now on hive os you should be able to but windows unfortunately steals i believe it's a giga hash let me know in the comment section below if it's a giga hash or about a giga hash so that takes it under the six giga hash minimum but you can see it's legit everything is great and uh yeah that was really awesome after opening the driver manager, everything seemed to be working really well. And again, I was just like, yeah, this is gonna be sick, dude. But when I tried to mine off of T-Rex, it would not work. It's saying because of the CUDA engine, which does make sense. There's a lot of cards that just don't work on T-Rex, unfortunately. And shout out to Yeti and Matt Electron for trying to help. And also Yashnik, they know who they are in Discord for trying to help out. So then we moved on and we tried some of the other programs. We tried a G Miner, we tried Team Red Miner, LOL Miner, hell, we even tried Tried out nice hash good old nice hash everybody loves nice hash so much i know i know the reasoning behind trying nice hash is generally nice hash is ahead of the curve hell they were the first ones to have the lhr unlock and so yeah yeti suggested that and it was a good suggestion and there was some picking up of the intel on nice hash but unfortunately it was just for the cpu side so really at this current moment after trying all of those it does seem that unfortunately while this thing is badass and cool as hell and i'm really excited for when someone unlocks it right now it's not minor supported so i did message my friend and uh, that's charlie once again from youtube and yeah hopefully he can ask his source uh, and i can't seem to find hash rates on either of these man that's the most important thing i want to find out like what are these things capable of. obviously this is four gig hash and it says a tdp of 25 watts so i mean i'm not expecting much like maybe three four mega hash on some things like I, I don't know i don't expect much for this one but it is cool and it's nice to have but the a380 you know you're seeing a couple videos now about these but nobody's talking about the hash rate i don't i can't find it if you can find it please let me know but i haven't seen a single person that is mined with this card or really either of these cards and i'm very excited to figure out what is the hash rate and again let me know what you think this card is now to get into pricing i actually purchased this a380 from ebay i wish i would have hit up my friend and i don't know why i didn't think about it man i was just like i wonder if you can purchase this gpu and yes 
you could at that time purchase this GPU. It cost me $400 plus $50 in shipping plus another $35, I believe. So just about $485 for this GPU. And you're probably thinking, wow, the MSRP is supposed to be like $130 around there. I know, I know, but I mean, you can't find them and I don't plan on keeping this to be quite honest with you. It's cool, but it's not $500 cool. I just wanna be like the first to ever show the hash rates or at least that I know of one of the first is good enough for me. But unfortunately, until the miners unlock it, it doesn't look like that's what's going to happen. If I would have purchased it off my friend Charlie, I'm sure it probably would have been around $250, maybe. I don't know. You'd have to ask him. I don't really know. But it would have been a lot cheaper than paying almost $500. And then this one here, actually, this is about $200, I think. Uh, I can't really remember. Plus, you know, you got to talk to him, shipping to your area, all these other things, how fast you want to get it. I obviously want to get mine a lot faster. You know, the pricing could go up or down because please understand that he gets it from different vendors and such. So I don't know if you'll find it. And actually on eBay right now, there's zero for sale. So yeah, you're really not supposed to be able to get these GPUs, which is why I'm assuming that LOL miner, G miner, nice hash, really everybody, definitely not Hive OS because they're always like last to the, to the game. But I want to know just as bad as all of you, like what type of, of wattage are we getting? What type of efficiency? So hopefully one of these miners does pick it up. I really look forward to it. If you share this video, I'm sure there's got to be a way somebody out there that can figure it out. It can't be that difficult. They probably just don't have it in their hand because obviously, like I said, there was only five on eBay and they were all sold out so fast and that's it. It looks like it's gone. So I don't know where they would exist at or whatever, but hopefully if you like this video and share it with someone, one of the miners, maybe they can figure it out. Maybe I can help them or assist them to figure it out. And then I can finally get you guys those overclocks and some hash rates. And we could see what these puppies can do because I'm very excited to not just have Nvidia and AMD, but have that third party, not just have like this monopoly or whatever, right? It'd be really interesting what they do. And I don't think it'll be anything crazy, maybe 20 mega hash. I'm not really too sure on Ethereum, but it is still going to be really cool to find out. Like this video, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. DJ Mines, signing out.